finally starting to recognize stuff again. Feels good to almost be home. Cheers to that, friend. I just can't shake what Aiden was saying about us back there. We do get a lot of treasure. And I guess sometimes we might throw our weight around. What? No. Aiden's got a bad case of treasure envy, pure and simple. I don't know. Well, Olivia has point. Well, I guess we do always try and get all the best treasure. Yeah, but that just means we have great taste. Not that we're like bullies or something. Oh, Ruben. That well, place looks so no nice. Matter what Aiden thinks, there's one thing I know. What's that? They think we're awesome. They're back! You guys are back! Run! Tell everyone that our heroes have returned! <laughs> Well, that's a lot of people. Yep, New Order of the Stone is back in town. Ah, here they are. I like Olivia's armor the best. Oh, wait, no, no, no. This place looks amazing. Wow, look what you've done with this place. It looks freaking awesome. <laughs> Quite no, freak out back. there. Yeah, let's give you a high five. See that? Jesse high five me! Me! It actually hurt a little bit. Wow. And of course, painting fans. That wasn't a happy to see a scream. Yeah, that wow. uh, didn't That's sound new. like it. It somehow manages to evoke skulls. And tentacles while still doing the whole barfing lava thing. That seems unsafe. Oh, that thing looks completely dangerous. Eh, not my it looks fault. cool, but uh, still uh, unsafe. Uh, oh, stop your whining. What are your pathetic injuries in comparison to my majestic tower? Ivor? Of course, it's Ivor. Of course. Oh, Jesse, you're back. Don't listen to a word these fools tell you. It's a fire hazard! And your face is an ugly hazard! Yeah, so did you build this thing? So what's this weird structure? It's my new house! And also, uh, my gift to the community! If anyone's short on lava, this is the place to get more! <laughs> You're welcome! Jesse, all I wanted was what any man wants! A little house of my own! With loads of lava pouring on. No wrong uh, about uh, I know having it. Well, but your house wants to kill people. Yeah. You made a killer house. Exactly, killer. Shut up. I you can always build what you want. Person, but there have to be rules. Well, we have to tear it down. We can't let that monstrosity stand. <laughs> it's my house, Jesse. I have just as much a uh, right to build something as all these people, don't I? They're just jealous that I've got vision. Well, they've got... They've got... Community planning. Blech. I hate this uh, decision. I kind of want to... If uh, that uh, had some kind of... Uh, pool around that uh, lava, I would be okay with that. I'm going to hate myself, but I'm going to tear it down. Sorry, Ivor. Sorry, Ivor, but your house is way too much of a hazard to the community. Tear it down, everyone. Good call. Ah, slippery slope, Jesse. Today the lava house. Tomorrow, who knows what kind of rules you'll be imposing. Don't be a sore loser, Ivor. <laughs> I haven't seen you around in a while. So what can I do for you? Sorry about your house, really. It was uh, cool, but hey, the lava... I'm um, sorry about your house. Oh, now you're sorry? I'm sorry that I live in a time where people don't appreciate true genius! Ah, uh, would you get over yourself already so Jesse can show you what we found in the jungle? What? You did? <laughs> yes! Great to see you again! Let's do lunch! I'll bring the carrots! There's no telling who's listening. Meet me in the treasure room. Ten minutes. And bring the thing you found! So why do we trust the Ivor again? Please remind me. 
I have no idea. Well, if we're gonna tear this down, we better start getting some buckets together to scoop up all the lava. You got any iron? Oh man, no. I'm all out. <sighs> okay. We better go mine some more. We'll catch up with you later. Yeah, once we give this majestic house the funeral it deserves. Right. What he said. Nice, nice work today, today, guys. Yeah, not bad, right? Mm, it's like we should do this more often or something. Later, guys! Come on, let's go find Ivor. Wow, so... this place is really shaping up. I feel ba bad about that house a little bit. Oh, there's Lucas. Whoa, Lucas! I don't believe it! Oh, hey guys! You have some pretty cool stuff in here. So where have you been? Crazy stuff. <laughs> yeah, yeah, where have you out. been? It's been ages, where were you? Oh, you know, just helping to rebuild and stuff. Weatherstorm left a big mess up. <laughs> yeah, no kidding. a lot of homes got wrecked. That's really good of you to help out like that. We have so many other treasures. Boy, you've sure been busy. Oh, wow. You framed it. I'm him. Yeah. How are you doing? I really miss him. I think everyone misses Ruben. I really, really miss him. Every morning I wake up and just for a minute I can pretend that he's just in another room or rooting around outside looking for carrots. And then every morning I get to remember all over that he's gone. I'm so sorry. Yeah. <sighs> Jesse okay, hasn't just gotten over it. I promise I wasn't just here to bum everybody out. I actually came back because I need to tell you something. It's about this weird run-in I had. With Aiden. Oh, yeah, we, uh, hate that guy. we ha saw, saw him did, too. It really got to him. Uh huh. Yeah, we saw him too. The Order of the Stone and the Blaze Rods are just as friendly as ever. That's an understatement. He's just <laughs> been so jealous of you and the rest of the Order ever since you saved the world from the Wither Storm. He's convinced that he was supposed to be a hero. Ever since he took oh. over the Ocelot and the Blaze Rods, it just seems like he's gotten meaner. He's pushing my Why is kill it around. He jealous? jealous? Why? He thinks you're a big bully, Jesse. Looting and keeping all the good stuff for yourself. So what'd you find that got Aiden so excited anyway? Check it out. Wow. What a weird glow. Yeah, I know. I'm supposed to show it to You found it! Yeah! Oh! Dude, what's <laughs> wrong with you? This is the greatest fight of our time. I can't believe you're actually... That it's you're actually so holding special. this! I mean, it's got some Someone's sort of enchantment, but it's just a flint of steel, it. right? Jesse, that's not just some sort of enchantment! That glow, that enchantment, is the work of a very old group of builders. A group so old that they existed even before the Order of the Stone. Whoa. Yeah. Dramatic. Did they right? build the temple? Wow, so that temple we went to, was that built by these old builders? That's my suspicion. But it's what's inside the temple that interests me even more! You see, if these builders truly existed, and if you found their temple, that means we're one step closer to finding the Eversource! What a beautiful sight! Looks like you the came back what? just in time, Lucas. More powerful artifacts, huh? The Ever... what now? The Eversource! Are you, uh, gonna actually explain it any more than that? The Eversource is said to be an object of incredible power possessed by the old builders. It was some sort of treasure or artifact that gave them an endless supply of precious materials. So, Go kind of like Jesse. a creative That mode. temple must have been its hiding place! Wow! Old builders? You learn something new every day. I'm still How can you be so sure? Sure. Okay, so this flint and steel might have this old builder enchantment, but how do you know that's where this Eversource thing is? I've traveled near and far, Jesse, and that temple, that flint and steel, is the only firm proof that I've ever seen of the old builders. 
That does seem like a pretty good bet. Old builders, ever sources, mm. ancient mysteries. You know I'm in. Excellent! I'll pack my adventuring things immediately. Wait, he's coming? Wow, sounds like you guys have a lot to get to. I, uh, guess I'll take No, a no, You're no. You're coming with. Yes. I need a buffer between me and Ivor. <laughs> Let's get moving. I'm still not sure why we're friends with Ivor. So exciting. <laughs> Adventure! Lucas, I know it's daytime, but and watch Ivor your backs, has okay? become just a kid as well. We're bringing Ivor with us. I mean, it's nice that he's so excited, but oh, not my top choice for adventuring companion. Well, he's no little that when it comes to all this ancient history and treasure, Ivor knows a lot. Sure, that's true. These trees are enormous. I love it so much. He just really gets on my nerves sometimes. Remarkable. Look at this architecture. So old. So exquisite. Oh, this is just how I dreamed it would be. Except for We are in the right place. My dreams usually involve cake. So you think it's the right place then? Oh yes, Jesse. Oh yes, I very much do. Wow, it looks so different during the day. Okay. Careful what you touch. There could be traps everywhere. Petra, long guy, are you two as excited as I am? I'm not sure that's possible. What? She so... means that you just seem to be super excited, Ivor. It was wait. Arcos. Yes, they are active, but so I guess we need to start by blocking first one and then Basically, the opposite of what we did uh, first. Hmm. Or maybe not. Let's see. Huh. Doesn't look like those lava channels work anymore. Can I. What can I actually do now? Let's talk to Ivor. Look excited, Ivor. Excited. I'm ecstatic. Thrilled. Overjoyed. The Eversource could finally be within my grasp. And you sound uh, angry now. Once, uh, once we find it, that is. Okay, nothing. So, Petra. I can't believe we missed some sort of secret area here last night. Uh, we were kind of fighting. Oh, a ton of monsters. It's not surprising that we didn't hit every single nook and cranny. And that's a kind of strange that the voice acting was completely different. Well, idea was the same, but it was otherwise different from the, the subtitles. So, Lucas. Do you Pretty have cool anything temple, to say? Right? Yeah, it's amazing. Not gonna lie to you, Jesse. I'm pretty excited to be along for the ride on this one. So what can we not do now? It just seems like there's nothing we can interact here. Mines, it's lava. Now, what can I actually do here? Now, I'll be honest here, I'm a little bit of confused here. Some sort of room up there. That oh. looks promising. I'm heading up. Fantastic. We'll follow right behind you. Uh, yeah. What he said. 
So you think this I'm not thing sure is up here? what I did to trigger that, but oh well. Hard to say, Jesse. As the story goes, the old builders feared its potential, so they hid it away in a place where it would never be found. And ha! It never has been. So what? This. What is Jesse doing up there? I'm examining stuff. Uh, Hold your horses down there. Well, that seems promising. And that will be open up that once I step on it. Jesse! What do you see? <gasps> it's some kind of portal? It's just as I'd imagined. Spectacular. What kind of portal is that? That's a weird looking that? portal. Have you seen anything like it before? No. The old builders experimented with portals, but... This is different from anything I've seen. Here goes nothing. Yeah. Well, that uh, exploded. Oh, thanks for bringing this back to me, Jesse. Dave I knew you were back. something. Give it You're back, pretty easy Aiden. to follow, you know that? That thing is way bigger and more powerful than you can understand, Aiden. Give it back. Says the person who just got knocked trying to light it. Step aside, Jesse. We're heading through that portal now. Oh, no way! Aiden, you're done. This is where it ends. Fine. Blaze rods! Clear me a path. Time to duck. E. QQ. E. A proper vibe here. Let's go! We've got to follow. Oh dear. If they get the Eversource, who knows what trouble they'll cause? So do we get the uh, Axel and Olivia? Should we go back for Axel and Olivia? There's no time, Jesse! Can't let Aiden get the Eversource first! I don't usually like agreeing with Ivor, but he's got a point. Who knows what kind of trouble Aiden could be causing in there? Good point. Yeah, I guess you're right. And so, we are heading into that uh, Sky City now, I think. 